Uh, this is definitely a bonus. Um, I used to live around here until September and uh, it was all fenced off around here so it was close as I can get to the uh, Bryce Glen Viaduct and uh, you have this pile on in front of me and it's all fenced off, you can't get onto the viaduct. At one stage, 10 years ago, a few years ago, you get uh, access to the viaduct from this size but you can't. You have to come off the uh, Cherrywood Road to get access but this is fantastic. This just shows you uh, Hopefully one day a Lewis, Lewis tram will cross it, or maybe heavy rail in the, in the decades to come. Unlikely, but I suppose we can hope for the Lewis. I suppose it will come down through there and uh, go across the viaduct. But this is more or less the same location I'm at now where uh, the train stopped. The uh, A-class train stopped in the Johnny Nobody film. And uh, you would have had gangers tending to the, uh, tending to the track and this beautiful sound of that engine coming over the viaduct and heading towards uh, Carrick Mines. So there's the track alignment there. So uh, there you go. Nothing remains obviously of the uh, the track bed. At last saw a train, like that would have been in the spring of 1960, but at last saw the lifting train would have been late summer 1960, um, probably about September when the tracks were lifted over the line. And uh, so there's, uh, I was last on it, I was last on it two, nearly two years ago on the anniversary, the New Year's Eve 19, um, 2019. So the 61st anniversary of the closure of the line. So um, that's fine, that's uh, fantastic. It was a highlight before, you can see in a different world, an alternative world, there was, um, but the line was still here, you know, you have all this uh, well, commercial development and residential development in this area. There would have been a station, there probably would have been a railway station close by where I'm standing. And uh, it probably would have been a station here, near the viaduct, or could have been. Thanks, Todd. So I don't know if I can, you can see the viaduct from this side. Let's have a look over here. It's muddy underfoot here at the moment. It's not good. Get to the grassy area. Oh, there's the viaduct there. Coming into view. Oh, fantastic. You just have to pick out the arches and the fence at the other end. But you can get access to it from the other end. Well, that's a beautiful view there. It's definitely a bonus, I didn't expect to get this today. This is fantastic. Imagine a train coming across that or in its day, right up to the early 50s, a steam train. That's oh, wonderful to see. So it's a significant part of uh, the Harkin Street Line infrastructure just there. Very windy, I'll have to get a microphone. Okay, please subscribe to my channel, just so I wanted to do a short video. Here. So this is uh, just uh, have a safe and happy Christmas, and um, that's probably my last video today. Well, I said that before, but more than likely it's my last video today. I've done quite a few today, so very productive Christmas Eve. Take care. Bye now.